What is up, my illiterate bumblefox? And today we do not have a proper video. Well, I don't say proper video. I don't have any like Call of Duty or Battlefield or anything in the background. And that's mainly because I want to talk about something. Like fucking always. But this time it's a little bit, a little bit more, I don't know, fuck. Something a little, I don't know, affecting the whole fucking YouTube community. And I guess I put my two cents on it, because you know what, I'm just a cunt. And so are all of you watching, because who else would watch me? Now, unless you have Alzheimer's, you know that KSI left the side men and... That whole fuck it, I don't know what's the shit between American YouTubers and fucking British YouTubers. First of all, let me get my fucking, I don't know, my little fucking insight in there, alright? In KSI's latest video, he repeatedly, like, calls out fucking Ethan, basically. Why? I'm the inside man. Uh, mainly because of Ethan. Can't stand him. I mean, if that Ethan bitch wasn't there, then obviously everything would be fine, but... Ethan looking bigger, I can see them. I'm a Yo bro man, what do Yo. you what do you what do you think about that Ethan dude? Cool. Respect my decision to uh leave the side men because of Ethan. It's been working as out of GWT. Fuck Ethan. And yeah, when I first saw that, I thought it was fucking, I don't know, like sarcasm or some shit, because that's what he usually does. My second thought it was fake, and I'll tell you why in a second. But like, even KSI himself said you, sh you shouldn't take his shit seriously. People don't know what I kind of mean by it, and whether or not I'm, I'm being sarcastic. Okay, yeah. Does that, did that ever affect you? Um... Or did your viewers just never take you seriously? I feel like my yeah my fans never really took me seriously whenever i'd say something yeah because I, I would i'd say i trolled a lot on yeah. my channel so because of that people were like oh if, if i said i'm coming out as gay people would be like this stuff definitely yeah. a joke but no but going back to this whole shit but fucking idolizing youtubers like, i don't get why the fuck people do that all right it's just fucking it's fucking stupid i'm just thinking right that they're trying to like Cause what was it Zerka put up a fuck like what was it a couple fucking tweets or whatever and so did fucking Calux. But honestly, I don't get why fucking why are we caring so much about American YouTubers? All right, is it because everyone's moving there? Fucking if that's the reason, then fucking I'm off to America. Cause America has nice things in the UK with fucking homeless sluts. Cause what was it? It was like fucking Team Ten side. I I all right. First of all, I have no idea what the fuck's going on with Team Ten. That's this fucking cunt called Jake Paul or some shit, and apparently everyone hates him. So there's that. Now, right, I think the KSI video is fake. Well, not the whole KSI video. I, I'm on about, like, the whole drama between fucking Ethan and KSI. KSI put up a fucking song, whatever, called Creature. And in it, he's like, fucking love and forgive, am I right? But you know what? Fucking KSI, you know, he's, he fucking, he's a hard, he's a hard thinker. He is, he fucking switches his opinion left, right, and fucking center. He's like a fucking teenage girl. Fucking indecisive as shit. All teenage girls might have been offended. I'm sorry. You know what? At least you're not that sniper wolf slut. And the whole way, like, the video was set out, like, fucking, especially that M bit, where it was like, but like, at the end, everyone was on about, what was it, Ethan or whatever the fuck. Apparently, Ethan sucks or whatever. I mean, not gonna lie, Ethan does look like, uh, he could easily get molested in prison, but that's a different story. Now, personally, I like both of them. I like Ethan. I like KSI. I mean, fucking... KSI can make his own fucking decisions, where he leaves the Sidemen or not, I don't give a fuck. If he's happier not being with the Sidemen, fair enough, not, we can't fucking blame him. If he wants to live with fucking FaZe Banks and Rice Gum, then that's fucking, that's his own choice, and probably be fucking better for him, who knows. This whole thing is basically like, okay, right, KSI's gone to America, we need to start drama in the UK so we get more views. And what, what is this, like, all of a sudden, why are we all fucking competing? Why? I thought, I thought this platform, we fucking help each other. You know what fucking YouTube used to be? I don't know why I clapped there. It's fucking... I'm retarded. How the fuck are we struggling? We've got people like Casper Lee and shit, unless they've gone to America. Because over here in the UK, it's basically fucking slums, like, everywhere. Wouldn't be surprised if we get a second dose of the fucking plague. But with these tweets, with Kalex and Zerka, and fucking KSI, and the weird-ass fucking video, it's just not fucking, like, I don't know, KSI's type to fucking do that shit. I guess I think it's fake, because fucking... The, the video was so dumb. It honestly was. You gotta just said, like, I'm leaving the side, man, respect my decision or whatever, and apparently people didn't fucking respect his decision. Holy fuck, look at the dislikes. But yeah, guys, just don't fucking buy into this shit, because it's all fucking fake. Any drama you hear nowadays is just a publicity stunt. Sorry, but am I right in saying, who the fuck wants drama anyway? But this loops back to the whole idolizing YouTubers shit. We all like our favorite fucking YouTubers. We all fucking respect them. Well, some anyway. 
<coughs> Jacob Sartorius. If KSI fucking dis actually dislikes Ethan, then fair enough, right? But none of this fucking drama shit should be happening. Zerk is like, we need fucking upcoming UK YouTubers and shit. <laughs> oh boy, gonna join the fucking Sidemen. No, I like everyone in the Sidemen. I fucking do, alright? But their name is not fucking suited. I mean, it's like fucking Rooster Teeth, alright? If you didn't know, Rooster Teeth actually means cockbite. So, uh, yeah. Serious company that promotes their name... Cockbite just sounds like someone's fucking porno to be honest. But yeah, I think that's enough for me today because you're all probably fucking fed off of me. I'm probably gonna get a shit ton of dislikes because people are idolizing, so it's fucking stupid. Stop idolizing your fucking YouTubers, alright? They can defend themselves. Your YouTubers are fucking smart. Well, most of them. YouTubers are smart. They know exactly how the fuck to get your attention. And if it's by drama, they'll fucking do it. It doesn't matter what it is. So just as a warning to everyone, so don't comment on KSI's video saying I'm gonna rape Ethan's nan. And don't go over to KSI's channel and tell him to go kill himself. This whole Team 10 shit, I'll fucking discuss it if people want me to, but holy shit. My final thought, this whole KSI Sidemen fucking stupid ass drama is just bullshit. It's all of it's fucking bullshit. Don't believe it. But yeah, thanks for watching the video. Please like, subscribe, and share this video around. Because maybe your friends are psychopaths too. Thanks for watching. And buy fucking supply drops.